I don't trust it. I just want to walk into the room itself. It's so quiet. Oh god, we're here. Please let me leave. Yeah, I feel like uh, we're kind of close to the end, but at the same time, I'm not sure what's going to happen over here. Especially if I have to kind of like travel around for a bit before I get to the exit. We'll give it a little bit of time and see if we have enough time to go forward. And see if we can wrap it up here today. I would like to wrap it up here today, but the problem is I don't want this episode to run too long. I was beyond her point! Okay. Well, whatever. I'll take the bleeding damage. I'll just heal it up later. So this over here is going to be blocked off to us. Nothing down here. We could go upstairs or downstairs. Let's try upstairs first because I think that might be a dead end. So if we know it's a dead end, at least we could kind of um, scratch it out. It is not a dead end at all. Okay. Nothing useful here. This door is locked. This one is not. That's tightly locked. And we could hide here. Alright, so we know we could hide here if we get chased. No other items. Alright. I'm trying to just keep an eye on to make sure that we're getting all the notes too. Because right now that's kind of revealing what's happening here. Another coin and... Nothing useful. Uh, okay. I hear footsteps now. I can come in here. Alrighty. Nothing useful. Nothing useful. I'm just being silent because I hear the footsteps outside. I might have to make a dash for it at some point. Bandage. I am bleeding, so let's go ahead and take care of that. Okay. I hear her here, but she just might be to the right-hand side with any luck. There's another save room, so I'll take that one. Oh, son of I should have seen that, but again, I keep rolling with my flashlight off. Oh, another note, good. Old notes, Relics 3. Every relic has both physical and spiritual forms, and relic that has been brought into the coma will usually manifest as its physical form. While here, the one may hold what appears to be the relic in hand, that is merely its spiritual form. Sometimes powerful relics can bestow their power, their owners with powers. Of course, the energy itself is without volition, leaving the owner to freely wield its power. Okay. Nothing useful. Useful. And we can hide here. Okay, great. At least we're kind of mapping out this area, so... With any luck, maybe we just have to get to the end and we go down the stairs over and over and we'll be fine. Of course, that would be asking way too much. I hid before she came in here. Don't tell me otherwise, game. Let's have ourselves a little bit of a health recovery session here. I guess we'll have this one here for now. Yeah, yeah, I I'm gone, lady. So any luck, any luck, we go left and all the way down, I mean... I doubt the game would make it that easy on me, but I can only hope for the best, I guess. She... should be gone. Yes. Don't be outside. Good. And as easy as it sounds to just run to the exit, I am so curious about these notes, so... Ah, of course, poison! We'll never get rid of poison because I keep catching it every single moment. Here's another one. Exiting the coma. In the integrity of a relic, if the integrity of the relic becomes compromised, for example, it's if it's broken apart, its strong pull in the coma makes it impossible to cross back to the physical world. This pull can only be escaped with the full relic. Owners cannot be roused from the coma by real-world sounds or even physical contact. In a worst-case scenario, one can become completely disconnected from the real world. I would really hate that for that to happen right now. So, I hope that's not the case. If that is the case, though, I'm not playing the same anymore. Nope. No sorry, Bob. Alrighty, so... I think I hear her outside, but my stairs potentially should be there. I hear the breathing. I don't hear the footsteps. Okay! It's fine. We'll just, um, get around her. Come inside. And please tell me that the stairs work! They do. Can I go back down again? Yes. I could go all the way down. She's after me, guys. Oh my god. Come in here. Oh, I, I skipped the classroom. Maybe. I don't know. For all I know, maybe the, the second floor was actually blocked off. I'm just going to go down right now. Fuck it. 
I'm trying to drop a heal a health pack too because if <gasps> I was right. I was completely right. Okay, hold on, hold on. Whew. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Just as I suspected. Uh let's take this bag off. Just as I suspected. Good thing I pretty much ran by because um obviously it's not gonna be that easy to get to my classroom. Um, so luckily, I think we're supposed to be where we're supposed to be right now so far. So that's fine. Now, with any sort of luck, we might have to just traverse the first floor to the end, go upstairs, and then that's going to be our entrance to the classroom. With any luck, I mean, obviously. Not be, might not be the case. I get the feeling this could be the end. That's what I'm trying to, like, I, f I guess we'll probably run this episode a bit longer here if we have to. But I would love to get to the end, so I could finally not have to look forward to dying in this game over and over and my heart hurting over and over. So that's fine here. It will come down. Oh no, now we're talking about Jump Portals game? Ah, uh, Where am I? Wish I knew, man. No, I'm not, I'm not down for the Jump Portals at this point. The Shade. I found the rusty recorder that corroborates an old tale I heard. The victim it belonged to has become the most powerful ghost roaming the coma of Sewa High School, The Shade. She's extremely dangerous now and beyond my powers of control. I was able to imprison her, albeit briefly, by using the recorder relic. Unfortunately, she has returned. Can she be eliminated for good? Okay. Wow, we're like, you know, nowhere on the map right now. Yeah, yeah, poison. Do whatever you have to do. Can I leave? No, of course not. So now we have like 70 different warps. Where the hell am I? I'm like right above my classroom now, it does seem. Oh my god. It's just poison over and over. There's warps everywhere. Do they all take you to the same place at least? Like, Or is it all just random? Are right, these two... This took me back. So this one just jumps you back. This one takes you to the next spot. That's what it seems like. Okay. So this here could be the one. Now, if I take this one, where does this lead me to? Back here. Okay, so they don't all lead to multiple spots, but some of them will just kind of return you back to where you started from. So I guess this might be the room where I'm supposed to be after all. Let me try this one here really quickly. Yeah, okay. That's not too bad. I think we might be able to make this work. Bandage. Alright. Let's we'll step outside. Coin. Hiding spot? Hiding spot, okay. Jesus. Try my flashlight here for a second. My god, where am I? <laughs> this is like going into the abyss. This is crazy right here. Alright, but luckily there's nothing here we found out. Turn this off here. Don't want to alert Miss Song to our location. What do you guys think? Go, um... To the right? I guess to the right would seem... Not where I'm supposed to be going. Alright. The left it is! Okay, I hear a lot of, like, growling. And I guess that's why. <laughs> Luckily there was this here. Um, okay. If I'm supposed to be here for a fact, I would imagine we have to step out. Potentially come in here. Is she still after me? I'm not sure she's she's outside, I think. That's fine. Okay. Gave her the old slipper roof. Nothing useful here. There was another item around here, but I was uh, too busy running away for that one, so another note. Perfect. Relics 2. Each relic has its own gravity. This anchors the owner of a relic to the coma. Just as one is bound to the earth by gravity, so too is one bound to the coma by the weight of his or her relic without full possessions of the relic. What brought one here? Exiting the coma is difficult. This gravity must be overcome. Alrighty. Another item here. Nothing useful. Getting some weird static now, too. Alright, so I hear her growling outside in a sense. Okay. Thankfully, we just skipped that one here. So, 
If I'm not gonna get stuck out here, this might be... Where I thought I had to go, but apparently not, because this is gonna be locked out, isn't it? Huh. Huh. So, what would be the... the proper exit plan here, then? It's obviously not any of those. Ah, son of a biscuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get it out of the way, that's fine. What if I use these... Which one did I came in from? The center one? Okay, so... Oh, this is... Where the hell is this leading me to now? How did I... Oh, the vents! Oh, I'm in the second floor now. You hide? What is... I'm so confused with everything that's happening. So I somehow took the center one, which was the thing I had to do, and it brought me here by taking the vent. I am so confused, but I somehow made it here, so I can't really be complaining about it right now. So, with any luck, maybe a... Oh, of course! Of course, with any luck, but I don't get lucky that often here. Oh, that would be it. What if we just go downstairs, then? And... Huh. Have we been in here before? Poison. Got a note here, maybe? Nothing useful. Got a note. Myungil! Even with this newfound power, all I ever wanted was some peace at school. That didn't stop Myungil from punching me in the face, though. Then he was... Then he has the gall to say, don't swagger like that. That asshole can't talk to me like that anymore. Whatever the cost, my girl's gonna bring that son of a bitch to his knees. I'm gonna hammer that slime mug of his till there's nothing left. Yeah. I don't know about that, Seho. Scumbag. Alrighty, we're a bit hurt here. I think we probably have some of the old potato chips. Get poisoned again, roughly, and back out. I'm not sure where to go. Here, I'm like literally... Where the hell am I at now? Back here again. How'd I manage that one? Huh. Not sure how we managed that one, but uh, apparently... Okay, so that leads me to that. Oh, this is so confusing right now. This leads me here. That one led me back. The middle one took me to... I guess maybe if we try to maneuver through these vents somehow? Can you do your little slash attack so I can walk by? Oh, cool. Yeah, of course. Let's see here. Nothing useful. Saw another pickup here. Another note. My relic. My pendant, a gift from a shaman girl, marked the beginning of my strange journey. It keeps my mind sharp in the coma and repels the shade. Without it, I would already be dead or imprisoned by the old evil. The ghost of Helant. I wonder if that's um, Jaisal after all. So we have, like, many of these. I guess one of them's the right one. And we just have to figure out which one's the right one. Alright, so let's try out the last one first and see where that takes us. Takes me to... All the way up here. Yeah, I don't think that's the right one. So you tell me I have to do this over and over until I basically hit the right one, more than likely. Oh, that's no good. Let's run by. Okay. So, can I just go straight up downstairs and then kind of maneuver myself around that way? And so it's not too bad. If you send me all the way out to some other area, then it's kind of bad. So, if I come down here and then... All we have to do is come in through here, right? This will bring us to the warp. Alright, good, good. So, we checked out the last portal. It's not the right one. Not the portal, but the last, like, hole in the wall here. That wasn't it. Let's check out the second to last. Doesn't seem like this one's going to be it, either. Oh, but there's a portal here! Oh! <gasps> I think I'm on the other side! I think I'm on the other side! Of, uh, my room! And the, the blockage that was there. Okay, I think I might have somehow made it. Uh, I'm about to die, though, so we need to make sure that we're going to be with full health here for whatever is ahead of us still. Let's, um... I do have an antidote. Alright, let's have this and let's have the poison one and there we go. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. we have, eh, might as well top ourselves up just in case. Okay, step out. <gasps> Are you gonna bring me into my room? 
I don't trust it. I just want to walk into the room itself. It's so quiet. Oh god, we're here. Please let me leave. Let me bring this fucking nightmare to an end. 5 a.m. It's still dark out. The board has been erased. There aren't any names written here now. The TV is off and that's weird. That weird video isn't playing anymore. Okay. But what about my exit? Do I have to sit down or something? Turn the flashlight on, I guess, maybe? Okay. Maybe um, I just walk out? <gasps> is it over? Please tell me the nightmare is over. Over? Your nightmare has just begun. Hey, what happened? Why is there an ambulance here? Some guy in one he had a seizure in front of his classroom. Whoa, was he an epileptic or something? Beats me, his name's Young Ho. Well, uh, that's what one of his classmates told me. Young Ho? Never heard of him. Yeah, no surprise there. Pretty sure he's one of those guys that hangs out at the internet cafes after hours playing spacecraft. Oh wow, no wonder. Those guys usually keep to themselves. I feel kind of sorry for him. Another incident in this school's going nuts. Damn, another one bites the dust, eh? Whoa, is that Young Hoser? You better hope the police don't get involved with this, Myungil. Hey, hey, why are you assholes looking at me? I have given him a hard time, but I'm, I'm hardly the one causing seizures around here. Myungil, enough. Your dirty mouth and antics aren't helping anything. How could this happen? Young Ho never had any problems like this. I swear I didn't do anything this time. I'm going to the hospital right after school. I want to see him. Seriously? I hear people get staph infections there and die. It's not worth it, babe. Stop calling me babe. I'd rather catch a staph infection than listen to another word out of your mouth. Wait, I'm coming with you. Ma'am, please stay there. His parents got the news and they'll be at the hospital soon. Okay, let's go. But, but, I'm his teacher. Then please attend to the other students. We'll make sure he's taken care of. Okay, let's go. Young Ho. He'll be fine, Miss Song. I know it. I hope so, Seho. I hope so. He was so close to escaping. And now the relic is back in the hands of the Shade. It's too powerful. Say well, hi has a huge problem in its hands. Young Ho, I need to bring him back, or he'll be trapped in a coma forever. Wow, and there you go. I'm not sure. I think that might have been the bad ending. I get the feeling it is, man. Assuming there is a good ending involved, I imagine it probably would be. Unless it's one of those games with the outcome, regardless of whatever you do, it's still going to be pretty terrible. But there you guys have it, the coma, uh, I played it to the end at the very least, um, if I knew how to go about the right ending, maybe I would have done it, but I'm not going through this nightmare again. <laughs> My heart could only take it so much. I hope you guys enjoyed it, don't leave a thumbs up, leave a like to support, this mean a lot, and thanks for sticking around, it really does mean a lot. I will catch you next time.